Hey everyone, what's up? How's it going? I'm Mariah and today we're going to be painting this 11 by 14 inch canvas. So let's get into it. So today is my first time painting after the holidays. I don't know what day of the week is. Just kidding, it's Wednesday. But yeah, I've just been relaxing this week. I'm really fortunate that the company I work for, they shut down completely for the end of the year. So my job is closed this week and really I've had a lot of time to reflect on this past year. Um, I started my business this year, so it was a really big step for me and kind of stepping into this unknown endeavor and just kind of seeing how far I was able to take it this year, just learning along the way has really, it's been cool to look back on and really take a second and reflect and think about all that I've accomplished and it's been really exciting thinking about my goals for next year and the direction that I wanna take my business. As much as I love pour painting, just logistically there have been some challenges as far as scaling up and things like that. So I do still love pour painting, but just thinking about different alternative routes that I can take to not limit myself. I really wanna get into drawing this year. I would love to draw on top of my artwork more and I love making mandalas, so maybe I can put that on my artwork. I've got a lot of ideas that I'm excited to put into motion this year. I'm thinking of a few changes, so stay tuned to hear more about what those might be once they're kind of finalized. I don't want to speak too soon. Anyway, I'm tired of doing holiday art, so today I wanted to make something completely different. I'm going to layer my paints in a cup and then pour it on and we will see how it comes out. I really want to thank all of you for watching this year, for subscribing to my channel, for being interested in my art, caring about what I make. I really appreciate your support. So thank you very much. I hope to continue making even better content in the new year. Okay, paint is in the cup. I'm also trying something new where I've got my iPad set up right in front of me here to see if I can get another angle of me pouring. The thing is, I have a couple of tripods, but none of them are big enough to hold my iPad, so it would be really cool if I could get an overhead view. I have a tripod for that, but I only have one phone to record, so hopefully I can get a pretty cool angle with my iPad. We'll see if it looks all right. If it does, I will insert it somewhere in the video. All right, let's get started. I'm excited. I haven't done a normal pour in a long time. I'm ready to let this baby fly. Wow, this is really cool. I, <laughs> when I first poured it, I wasn't sure how I felt because it was making some weird greeny, yellow, like muddy looking stuff. And I'm always a little bit cautious of greens. Green is not my favorite color, so I don't know. I don't always think I'm gonna love the way it looks, but this one it surprised me. But the way that the white is making this bubble effect with no torch or anything, I have no idea why it's doing that. Um, it looks really cool though, so. Can't wait to see it dry and varnished. I'll take my phone down to show you the finished piece. I'll also insert a photo and or video of this finished piece dry. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your support. Please like, please comment. Um, let me know what kind of videos you'd like to see in the future. 
and let me know what your New Year's resolutions are for 2022. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye. Hi guys. Here is the finished piece still wet. I just poured it and I'm sorry for the glare, but I really just wanted to zoom in and show you the details on this piece. Like, I don't know what's happening with the white cells, but it looks really cool. So can't wait to see this dry and I will update you soon. Hey everyone. So here is the dried painting. I'll zoom in so you can see it close up. Sorry for the lighting, by the way. I decided to film this after dark and it's winter, so <laughs> not the best lighting, but here are those little white cells that were made. They look really cool. I have not had another painting do this. This is definitely different than most and I think it looks really cool. It really adds to the effect. So I just have to varnish her and then she'll be done. Thank you again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you next Sunday in my next video. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.